Hello everybody, this is Ubuntu Gaiden again, and today I'm going to be showing you how to set up an email account in um, Mozilla Thunderbird in Linux. So first you're going to open up Thunderbird that we've installed. If you haven't installed Thunderbird yet, and you would like to, then I suggest that you watch my previous video. Now, the first time you open it, it will... Well, if you haven't added the launcher to the panel yet, you're going to go to Applications, Internet, and it'll be right there, Mozilla Thunderbird, Mail, slash News. But, the first time you open it, it'll show all these different things, email account, Unix mail, spool, move mail, RSS news and blogs, Gmail, or news group account. Since I have a Gmail account, since all my email is Gmail, I'm just going to select Gmail, and you're going to hit next. You're going to say your name, enter your email address. I'll just enter the one that I use for these videos. Ubuntu Garden at gmail.com. So after you've done that, you'll hit next. And then it's as easy as that. It'll show all this stuff. You don't have to enter any servers. You just have to make sure that POP3 or POP Mail is enabled so that you can do this. And download messages now. Make sure that box is checked and then hit finish. And now you need to enter your password for it. So let me just do that. Um, I would suggest using Password Manager to remember this password unless you're on a shared computer. My sisters don't really use this one, so I can do whatever I want to it. And then it'll just tell you about an alert for saving passwords and whatnot. You can just OK to that after you've read it. Sending for password does not succeed. MailserverPop.com. Your current is not enabled for POP access. That's right. I d haven't enabled that account for POP3 access yet. So, um... I will have to do that, but it's that simple. I'm sorry that you didn't get to see it work. Um, it's not as graphically pleasing as Evolution, but it gets the job done, and it's pretty good. So um, this is Ubuntu Guide. See you next time.